cookbook author and former model Chrissy Teigen gets a lot of attention for her social media activity. She seemingly will put her opinion and critique out there for anyone to read. Now, after some of Teigen's offensive tweets from 2011 have resurfaced, it looks like brands could be trying to distance themselves from the celebrity. Recently, Macy's quietly dropped Teigen's Cravings Cookware line from its website, according to Page Six. Macy's hasn't said why Teigen's products are no longer on the store's website, but they disappeared just a few days after model and singer Courtney Stodden accused Teigen of cyberbullying 10 years ago. Stodden told the Daily Beast that Teigen was one of several celebrities and journalists who mocked and attacked Stodden for marrying 50-year-old actor Doug Hutchinson. The two were divorced in 2020. In an interview with the Daily Beast, Stodden accused Teigen of both public bullying and in private messages. Publicly, according to Stodden, Teigen said she wanted Stodden to take a dirt nap. Stodden also alleged in a talk with the Daily Beast that Teigen would privately DM me and tell me to kill myself. While private messages between Teigen and Stodden haven't been substantiated, BuzzFeed has dug up what appears to be hateful public tweets Teigen directed at Stodden in 2011 and 2012 when Stodden was 17. After the BuzzFeed report, Teigen issued a profuse apology on Twitter on May 12th. Teigen tweeted, I was an insecure, attention-seeking troll. I am ashamed and completely embarrassed at my behavior, but that is nothing compared to how I made Courtney feel. Teigen's apology thread continued, I have tried to connect with Courtney privately, but since I publicly fueled all this, I want to also publicly apologize. I'm so sorry, Courtney. I hope you can heal now, knowing how deeply sorry I am. Stodden accepted Teigen's apology in an Instagram post the following day, but it's not clear how Stodden even saw the apology. Stodden is apparently blocked from seeing Teigen's Twitter account. In an Instagram post, Stodden challenged Teigen's claim that she reached out privately to apologize. Stodden posted, I accept her apology and forgive her. But the truth remains the same. I have never heard from her or her camp in private. All of me wants to believe this is a sincere apology, but it feels like a public attempt to save her partnerships with Target and other brands who are realizing her wokeness is a broken record. Meanwhile, all has been quiet on Teigen's Twitter and Instagram account since her May 12th apology to Stodden. Her cookware still shows up on Walmart's website, although a search for Cravings Cookware on Walmart's site on May 19th showed the product to be out of stock. Teigen's cookware was still available on Amazon on May 19th, but the online retail giant appeared to be almost out of the 12-piece aluminum set at the time of this video. Coincidentally, Fox Business reported one day after Teigen's apology that Target had also removed Teigen's Cravings cookware line from its website. The move appears to have nothing to do with the controversy between Teigen and Stodden, as a representative for Target told Fox Business that the decision to drop Teigen's cookware had been in the works since December. Target still sells Teigen's Cravings cookbooks. While Macy's has yet to make a statement about why Chrissy Teigen's cookware line is off its website, Page Six reported that a source familiar with the situation told the news outlet that Macy's removed Teigen's products from its website because people were expressing anger over Teigen's alleged attacks on Courtney Stodden in product reviews. Teigen's business problems appear to be only getting worse, too. Page Six also learned that Bloomingdale's canceled a planned promotional event and deal with Teigen just hours before the former model was scheduled to sign a contract with the big retail store. Bloomingdale's and Macy's are owned by the same company. Again, Bloomingdale's isn't saying anything publicly about the sudden change of plans, but Page Six claimed to have the inside scoop, reporting that the decision had to do with all the negative publicity Teigen has been getting over the past few weeks. If you or anyone you know is having suicidal thoughts, please call or chat online with the National Suicide Prevention Lifeline at 1-800-273-TALK-8255 or text HOME to the Crisis Text Line 741741.